Oh my gosh, I'm so happy this is back. I mean, it never really goes away because it's got a permanent location out by Stone Mountain Netherworld Haunted House. <laughs> God, that was incredible. Thank you, thank you very it was much. very, very good. Yep, Stone Mountain, that's where that's it is, good. right on West Park Place, right by the park itself. Their new location, I know you remember them off of Jimmy Carter Boulevard in 85, but now through November 9th, fearworld.com, it is one of the most intense, super spooky haunted houses in the country. Yeah. These folks get written up in haunted house tabloids. Mm. No. Yeah. No? No, thank you. you were, you're a scared? I get, yes, I do. Really? I do, yeah. Whoa. It all stems back to, ch stop, Whoa. crash, stop that. that. What was that? Cut it out. Well, you know it's all just you makeup know, and, and No, it doesn't matter. I don't. I just don't like to be scared. Okay. It all starts with the first scary movie that my parents didn't know I was watching on Home Box Office. Aww. That's when it was Home Box Office at my cousin's house. I was in second or third grade, and it was called The Omen. You were in No, thank you, Damien. No. She was, she was in second, second or, or third grade. Third grade, okay. Yes. All, no. right. All right, no problem. I, I don't like to be scared. Not the scary for you. Let's take you to number two, the Atlanta International Night Market. Ooh, okay. This is really cool. Out at North Point Mall. This will be going on tomorrow through Sunday. Look at the crowds out there. This is awesome. I mean, there are countries represented here. It's like me when I go to Epcot, you know, <laughs> right. and I go around the world and everything. Yes. ATLNightMarket.org, again, with more than 30, 75 national all represented out here. You get the food, you get the experience. One of the greatest international communities in the world. Enjoy, like I said, all the food from everywhere. It's so cool. All the performances, yes. the kids that are out there, the costumes and decorations and shopping and, ugh. Oh. It is. It's exhausting. There's so much. It's I a know. whole day's worth of fun out there. Yes, but again, you do feel like you are transported to other yeah. countries all over the world right in our own backyard. Yep, it is absolutely wonderful. I can't wait. Fun time, fun time. And the temperatures are going to start coming down, Please. so it's going to be great. I mean, we're not talking about like 50 degrees. No, no. The high is still going to be 80s, but at least we won't be sweltering in the heat. It's not so. in the 90s. Good. Yeah, and okay. what a great time for number three. Number three. Boom! Candler Park Fall Festival. Where? Yay. Candler Park. Duh. Okay, <laughs> Saturday and Sunday, fallfest.candlerpark.org. We're talking two full days of music, 200 artists, vendors, a tour of the homes. You get the 5K and the fun run for the kiddies, Kidlandia, Atlanta's best food trucks, free to attend, and all the proceeds go to Candler Park, the neighborhood organization. Great cause, great fun, great tradition here in Atlanta. And again, weather's going to be mwah. Mwah. Yeah. A fantastic. It's I good. love, love, love this time of year. Again, yeah. so much to do, so much to see. And if the temperatures drop, then everything will be perfecto. Yeah. Yes. And I mean, this is the time when we go to the pumpkin patches. Yeah. We go to all the mazes. Obviously, I know the haunted house is not for you. Yeah, but, but then you got to head up to some apple picking. Apple picking, yes. That's fun. Yeah. Good. I cannot wait. Yeah. It's okay. All and number four. All right, well, we got to talk about the home team because. Yeah. Because you're Atlanta United taking on New England, the revolution at Mercedes-Benz Stadium. Perfect. That will be Sunday at 3 p.m. ATLUTD.com. It's that simple. Get out there and support the uh, the five stripes. And uh, I don't know what the latest word is yet on Joseph Martinez, but I know he went out last game, and I have not really heard any updates, so I apologize for not being up to date on my soccer sports. Oh. But yeah. Yes, so, good that luck. Could, it could impact us. Yep. Oh, yep. for several games, possibly the it could, it could possibly be well into the playoffs. Yeah, that's okay. like a big, yeah. Ow! Okay, so, oh no. So we got your Braves, we got the Atlanta United, got to support the Falcons too. They're a little bit down in the dumps I right know. now, but they'll pick it back up. A lot of season left. I know, you missed it. Um, I told Ovi Mahaley, like, like he and I are best friends. Um, I got to see, or got tickets, Thanksgiving Eve, Saints and Falcons, 8-10 kickoff Thanksgiving night. Oh, huge. I know it's huge, but I need we need our Falcons to be. But no matter what, that rivalry. It's always a rivalry, it, it, yeah. Will it be a close game? I, I mean, I mean it, it should be. To watch. Well, I mean, you think about it. Drew Brees is out, but their backup right. guy has been doing great. Their defense is good. And Atlanta, the talent's there. They just got to put it Come together. On, guys. Come on. Yeah. Way to, way to go, coach. Yeah. That's right. That's right. All right, do we have a bonus? I do have a bonus, yes. And it involves two of my favorite things, brews and barbecue. Ooh, yes. Brews and barbecue for C. D-L-S. Now, this is at the Curahi, did I say that right? I probably hope, Brewing Company. There's the sign right there. We can all read it. This is up in <laughs> Alpharetta. This will be Saturday from 5 to 8.30. Check Fun. them out on Facebook at Brew and Barbecue for C-D-L-S. Now, this year's event features a barbecue buffet. Oh, my gosh. Yes, that please. sounds good. Live music, a chance to bid on so many silent auction items, including hotel stays. We all love that. A golf foursome, restaurants, along with trips to Italy and 
Antigua and an African safari. Wow. That's right. That All proceeds great. will go to the CDLS Foundation to help children and families that are affected by Cornelia de Lange syndrome. Look that one up there, folks, because I actually had a little uh, a little piece of the um, action last year and got involved with. That's why I had such a great time out at the festival. Good. So, yeah, great cause. A lot of great people out there and a lot of really cool items you could bid on. Okay, so, excellent. It sounded like it. Yeah. Um, and traffic. Uh, the usual stuff. Braves game tonight, 502. Don't underestimate the traffic. A lot of folks going to be heading to Battery Atlanta. You don't want to be late for first pitch. So just get out a little bit earlier. Construction-wise, just the usual amount of crazy construction of all over town. I yeah, know, I know. nothing earth-shattering. Just, yeah. just keep building. Um, exactly. What are you doing this weekend? Uh, tomorrow, I'm in a golf tournament for Children's Miracle Network out at Stone Mountain. Fantastic. That'll be a lot of fun. And then Saturday, unfortunately, my wife's out of town. Darn, what oh, am I going to do? What should you do? God, beer, wow. barbecue, football, football oh. baseball. Or I'm I could stay home and clean the house and surprise her. That, come here now. That's my crashy. He's a great hubby.